Hi, I'm Michael Halsett, and you are watching Oldie Goody. <laughs> Today, we're going to be talking about 1963's Dr. Strangelove, or How I Learned to Stop Worrying and Love the Bomb. This is probably my favorite film of all time. It's directed by Stanley Kubrick, one of my favorite directors. Dr. Strangelove is a Cold War comedy about a general who inadvertently starts a nuclear war. The majority of the story takes place after a mission is set in place that's going to set off a doomsday device in Russia. The United States government, as well as the Russian government and other governments, are trying to stop this nuclear apocalypse from happening. It's one of the funniest black comedies I've ever seen, and surprisingly still extremely relevant to this day. One of my favorite performances is, one, George C. Scott as a lead role as a general, and two, the three roles played by Peter Sellers, including Dr. Strangelove himself. The film originally had a hilarious, or so I would suppose, pie fight sequence in it, in which the president gets hit with a pie, and one of the people in the war room exclaims, our president has been struck down in his prime. This was actually removed before the film's release and reshot because just before the film was supposed to come out, John F. Kennedy was assassinated, leading to some significant changes in the film. Nonetheless, it's a hilarious movie and definitely worth a watch for the performances, for the directing, and for the writing. I have the Blu-ray book version of the film. The picture quality is phenomenal. I don't believe they make this specific copy anymore, but there is a Criterion Collection version of the movie, and that one is also beautiful as far as picture quality and sound quality go, and you can't go wrong. I recommend picking it up if you plan to buy it. If not, definitely rent the movie and check it out. Can't go wrong. If you like this film, check out other Kubrick films from the same time period. I can't recommend them enough. Thank you for watching, like, subscribe, and comment.